Greetings, I'm Caffeine Ranger. I'm back with more of Let's Play Grow Up. Still really trying to well, find a direction. Oh, uh, a crystal. Wow, right here. That's a way to start things. Really trying to figure out exactly what we're doing with this star plant over here on the map. When I restarted the game, this is a new recording session. It put me on this island. As Bud freaks the fuck out while I'm on the map screen, as usual. So let's just go ahead and glide over there and really just take a look. Oh, no. Hold. There we go. Yeah, Bud seems to be a little jittery today. Yes, Pod, we figured that out before. Actually, you told us several times. Okay, right there is a floating island that we could use to grow the star plant. And right there is another one. I'm not, I can't remember exactly how many more we have to get. I guess we'll find out one way or another. Oh. Yeah, let's secrets break just a little bit and just drop right in on this crystal. I mean, can you really secrets a uh, sequence break in this game? Oh, but we've talked about this. You're gonna have to go back on your medicine. Uh, uh, yes, yes, I realize it doesn't taste as fruity as the last ones, but still. Okay. So. Oh no. Forgot about the ball form. Don't really use it uh, all that much, to be perfectly frank. It just doesn't seem all that useful in a game about climbing, you know? Okay. Where is Glowy Floody Island? It's above me, isn't it? I think it's above it to my left. It's a little hard to see from here, though. It's actually behind that island. Oh, no. There we go. Yeah, it was behind that island. How sneaky of it. I didn't like that. But. Got you in the end. I think. Okay, and there's one more, which it was on the other side of this, wasn't there? Oh, bud. Yeah, I definitely need to put him back on his meds. And here comes a cloud that will just obscure things. We'll go over here. Okay. I really don't like the cloud cover in this game. I realize that it's Minecraft style, but it's very frustrating. To just have these giant blocks of white polygons just completely obscure your view. Maybe it's above me because I'm not seeing it below me. I remember seeing the other one. Well, bud, you get actually no points for style there. So how about some random gaming talk? Because that's always fun on these. And really need to fill some time without doing a lot of editing. I mean, it's either I talk randomly or I just start editing these. And I'm lazy when it comes to editing. <laughs> uh, since I last recorded this, the Nintendo Switch has come out and... Maybe it's just the fact that I'm old, but I just don't get the whole deal with the Nintendo Switch. Nintendo is quickly becoming the Apple of gaming consoles, and that's not a good thing in my opinion. I mean, Nintendo could be hailed for design flaws. Having the screen be uh, just a magnifier scratches and talk about how 
Dead pixels, uh, they aren't a defect because they are a common on LCDs. Yeah, 15 fucking years ago. But on a modern uh, LCD con uh, uh, LCD display, it's actually kind of rare to see uh, dead pixels. Or at least at the very beginning. I mean, you do get them eventually or get stuck pixels, but... you Just on launch and the fact that <laughs> there's it's very difficult to protect the damn screen because the thing puts out so much heat it melts off uh, screen protectors and you can't even put a vinyl skin on it because of whatever they built the console out of plastic was but then again they also are kind of like Apple where you can't use the product and charge it at the same time <laughs> uh, whoever designed that console needs to be shot or at least you know spend more than an hour uh, on uh, its usability. But then again, I'm also one of these freaks so I'll use my phone while it's charging, so there you go. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing this last island. Let's just start plugging uh, random things into things and see what happens. Whoa, frame drop. Didn't like uh, plugging into this island. Oh, we've been here. Maybe that's why I didn't like it. Hello, my friends. Okay. I think we got that one as well, Pod. Speaking of pod, let's do a challenge just to mix things up. And float up, fly up, and there we go. Oh, oh, bud, bud, settle, settle. Oh, there it is. Forget the challenge. That uh, served its point. It uh, allowed us to get a good view of things, and we would have went right past that, I think. Oh. Okay, but... Bam, clump, clump, clump. There we go. Yeah, I've really been thinking about this game, and... This doesn't feel like a really good YouTube game. This feels more like a Twitch game, you know, uh, very chillax and sit and talk to your uh, people in chat, but for YouTube where it's more solitary, at least, uh, uh, that's really the difference between YouTube and uh, Twitch, actually, is when the interaction is. Twitch is all about the interaction while the recording happens, while YouTube is, uh, you know, post facto. It's just uh, two really different beasts and lends themselves to two really different styles of games. Granted, there are games that work well on both platforms. I mean, RimWorld, for example. RimWorld's done really well on my channel. Well, for my channel size, I guess I should say. But at the same time, Games like this where there's not a lot going on at any one particular time, it doesn't lend itself nearly as well. Okay, let's climb, let's fly up. Actually, I just had a thought. Okay, oh, but, but, easy. Can we use this? 
If not, then I'm going to try one of the bubble plants. We. Uh, but. Uh, there we go. Oh. Oh. Settle. Settle. Set. But is your foot stuck? Okay. And. Impact. Well, that worked out well. Oh, shit. Did Bud let go because of the uh, terrain? Because I was holding the triggers. At least I thought I was. But yeah, I was just... I was thinking about the different types of uh, games on different uh, platforms. Mostly because Twitch is doing... Uh, they're trying to move more onto the uh, PC side of things. Uh, having a dedicated uh, program. I, I refuse to call uh, programs on uh, a desktop computer apps. Hello. Yep. One second. I'm going to go get the uh, teleporter before bad things happen. Because after all, this is Bud. Yank. But yeah, Twitch uh, recently announced that they're having a dedicated PC program uh, for streaming. Well, to watch streaming, I guess I should say, because there is dedicated programs to stream. Matter of fact, I use one to record RimWorld. But. Ooh, there, oh, there we go. Grab and pull down. Step down, bud. Okay, there goes the engine. We only have one more part. Okay, so... Let's see where that part is. I have thought about streaming, to be honest. But it, it, boy, this is going to sound really weird. It's... A lot of work. <laughs> but YouTube is not exactly... Uh, low on work. It's just, it's all on the front end. I'm able to set up everything beforehand and really take a hands-off approach during the week. And I'll set up my videos uh, during the days but, or during the mornings, but if I really wanted to, I could set up everything in a, a couple hours and not touch the channel again. And, uh, you know, that does hurt me on... Oh, okay, there's the last part. It's in the south. The south Pole. How, do, how the hell do I get up there? Is it those uh, rocks? Hmm. Weird. Okay, well. I didn't even see the. Uh... Yeah, I'm trying to see if I could see the marker from here, but there, I can't. Okay, so let's put one. Okay, there it is. Boy, talk about being close. Oh. No, what I need is this one. Let's get some extra altitude. Yeah, I've been thinking about streaming and it's something I want to do, it's just... Do I have the time on top of keeping up with everything on YouTube? That's going to be the real challenge. And I want to build a new system before I do that. Or a new computer, I should say. Yeah, oh, I can see the... Bud, what are you doing? Outside of just jittering. Maybe Bud needs uh, his morning coffee or something. Well, that would be uh, something interesting. Well, assuming people watch this. I do know I have a couple of people that watch my stuff, but I don't get a lot of comments on my stuff. Which can be a little frustrating, but at the same time, I, I do understand that, you know, maybe just watching some of my stuff or not really having anything in, uh, in particular to say. Or, you know, could be the game because this 
is a very chillax game. Matter of fact, boy, I'm actually gaining some real height here. This is a very chillax game, so I do understand, you know, may not be for everyone. Oh. But, there we go. Okay. Hey, look at that. The curvature of the... Well, not Earth, but still. Suck it, Flat Earthers. Can't believe that there's actually serious Flat Earthers these days. Okay, let's just go ahead and... Reset my waypoint. Yeah, I don't have enough altitude, but maybe I can do some platforming here. Oh, why did you uh, put away the thing? Yeah, it looks like I have enough altitude just using the jetpack going from one rock to another. Hey, we're actually going to do platforming on this uh, game. I imagine that... Platforming and a platformer. Okay, have we done that teleporter? No, we haven't. Besides, we don't have too much altitude above it, so. Oh. As I hit all the wrong buttons. So this is a good place to stop, drop. Wait, why did it? Okay, this one. Oh, why did I need to do that? There's one uh, naturally occurring. Okay. We. <laughs> trying to think of anything else that's really going on in gaming news right now. Uh, I do know PAX is going on and uh, GDC has uh, happened recently. I still need to go read the news about that, see what happened in all of those. But that's going to be more VGO uh, stuff or, than anything else, to be perfectly honest. You really do get a chance to really sit down and think about things while you're playing these games. I'm not sure if I want to play another... Well, I should say open world like this, but... Uh, that's not really fair to most open world games. I've been playing Mad Max uh, on my free time. Just a... Pod? Fuck you. I've been playing Mad Max on my own time, and... It, it's also an open world game. It's the Warner Brothers style of open world where, you know, you'll start going somewhere and then, ooh, uh, something else to uh, explore. Which, yes, I know that sounds like uh, most open world games. The real difference is towers. Because there has a... Well, there is towers in the game, but it doesn't... Oh, it's so weird. Yes, technically there are towers. Of a ship part somewhere near, let's keep moving before I freeze solid. I hope you freeze solid. Then maybe it'll shut up. How am I supposed to get up there? Yeah, that's a really good question. And maybe this uh, floating island will have the answer. Yeah, from this uh, perspective, uh, for a second there, it looked like, you know, the part was on this island, not, you know, the one that's probably about a kilometer above me.
Okay, I hear a crystal at least, so... Ooh, and a new plant. Okay, uh, it's not that plant I need to hump, it's this one. Let's see, this one looks kind of powerful. It's some kind of mutant floater. A big one. Okay, so... Oh, wait, wait. Crystal first. We need the power. Oh, oh, but, 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 stop, stop. Oh, this isn't so much I'm controlling, but I'm just kind of gently nudging the direction that I want him to go. And let him do his own thing. Okay. We. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Is just keep putting down more of those? Okay, it looks like I could get to this one. And land. Oh, that was close. Oh, damn it, bud. Fucking gravity. No, it's more fucking bud. Uh, but, but, bud, stop trapping your head on things and get on the damn flower. Get on the damn flower. Get on the flower. Okay, well that works. Hopefully that whatever's beeping is on this island. Ooh, a crystal. Okay. Just slowly scurry over this way. Oh, did I go past the crystal? No, it's up there. Okay. And... Ascend? That's just a pod challenge. I'm not going to worry about it. I swear it looked like Bud was uh, pointing downwards with his jetpack. I lost track of the crystal. Don't care. Is this the island that has the part? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. The island of the part. really watch Dragon Ball Z. The closest I've come is Dragon Ball Abridged. Honestly, that's good enough for me. It was popular when I was in high school, but the thing is that I watched a few episodes and I must have picked the worst episodes because it was all the fighting episodes. Yes, yes, I realize. Uh, talking about Dragon Ball Z, the worst episodes being the fighting episodes, but it's the ones that they're powering up, so it's just constant screaming for, you know, half an hour. Okay, this is... Oh. The other ship part. Uh, what number is that? Just kidding. Uh, I never forget. Uh, I'm like a flying metal elephant. Come. Really? So we're doing it this way now. I can't tell if that's Bud freaking out or Pod freaking out. There you go. Oh. Oh. How the hell does he lift this thing? I mean, it's a matter of weight ratios. A five-pound satellite can't live, lift a five-ton chunk of uh, spacecraft. It can't be done.
Okay. That's all the parts. Let's get to the moon. So... How do I do that? Do I have to go get Kennedy? I mean, really, how am I supposed to get to the moon? I don't see all see Deal Armstrong around here anywhere. Okay, let's look at the map. See if that gives me any hints, because that's really our final goal now is uh, moonshot. And, I mean, right there is the moon. Mm. Yeah, just looking to see if there's any... Oh, there we go. That looks promising. Let's put a marker on that and see where it points us. And once again, I'm not seeing the damn marker. Which is a little discouraging. I mean, right there is the moon, right? Oh yeah, the marker is right under it. That has to be how we get there. I hope. But let's le leave that for next time. Yeah, a little bit of a tease and maybe actually finishing this, this week, I don't know. So, as always, feedback is greatly appreciated, either through the comments below or if you don't really have anything in particular to say, but want to let me know that if you've even watched this, then <laughs> hit, the, uh, hit the buttons on uh, your thoughts uh, down below and subscribe if you see more of Grow Home, even though I have a feeling there's not going to be much more. Unless there's like a second adventure for Bud. Actually, technically, this is a second adventure. Oh. They love to put just random noise in this game, don't they? Let's just go over here. So I can actually hear myself think. Which I realize is, you know, not all that much, but still. Uh, if you wish to see more of Grow, Ho Grow Up. I keep calling this Grow Home because, you know. That, that feels more like what this game should have been named, but, uh, and Grow Up should have been the other one where you were actually climbing the fucking beanstalk the entire time. Or my other content, RimWorld, uh, <laughs> Divinity Original Sin, whatever uh, replaces those in the coming months, because they eventually have to end at some point. Well, maybe not RimWorld, because I'm enjoying RimWorld still, and still a lot of bond combinations out there. Anyway, I'm done rambling. Let's get out of here. I'll see you next time.